lovely people, how are you guys doing? What's up? We are back in the kitchen after a long break. The last time I tried cooking something on here, the food was so tiny, <laughs> even an ant would have still be hungry. Brother, uh, what's that? What's that, brother? I've somehow managed to disappoint even the ants. Today, I have a mission. Things are gonna get serious. In Japan, they have this sandwich called fruit sando. <gasps> Did anyone say sandwiches? <gasps> yes, but it was not me. Good, because I like sandwiches. Actually, it was me. Why were you hiding under the table? I mean, it's... I can't answer that question. Well, that explains a lot. Does it? I don't know. The Sando fruit sandwiches are made with bread. No. Every sandwich is made with bread, whipped cream, and fruit, usually strawberries. There are only two ways I can do this. Oh yeah, we have options. I can try making the sandwiches the traditional way, the way that you find them in stores, in vending machines, but that's a little predictable and also a little boring. Or I can try making some of the more creative version of the sandwiches and absolutely hate myself throughout the whole process. This is going to be very challenging. I kind of want to do it though. I woke up and chose struggle. I chose it must be going wrong. I didn't say it, I sneezed it. Okay, but quick question. How do we make whipped cream? Oh, it's pretty simple. You get some cream. You add some sugar. And then, surprise, you whip it. Or in this case, I whip it. You are just watching me whip it. I forgot something. What was I even thinking? Okay, I think it's ready. So, a uh, long time no see. Safety comes first. I think I need to cover my eyes. I'm gonna need some bread. I bought bread with no crust. I thought that would save me some time. This is the saddest thing I've ever seen. I like bread crust. This feels like I'm holding a crime in my hands. Who did this to you? Mmm, it smells like bread. I'm gonna try it. It tastes like bread. It's actually kind of nice. You know what? I'm gonna try to do it without any tutorial. Oh, that's a very good idea. I'm just gonna look at the image, which is this one over here, and I'm gonna try to make it myself. First thing is first, I'm gonna need some cream. I'm gonna apply a nice thick layer. How thick is too thick? And how thin is too thin? And now, I need a knife. <sighs> here is where it gets difficult. This is why I need to stop using my mouth and start using my brain. Well, that feels odd. The way I place the strawberries will determine if my sandwich is going to be an absolute mess or a success. So the big question is, do I place them like this, like this, like this, or like this? Do I place them in my mouth? There is a tutorial, but I don't want to look at it. I'm going to place them like this. So when I cut it and I open it, yeah, I think that will work. No, don't, don't move. Don't make me smack you with the spatula. Ah, don't be violent with the strawberries. Oh boy, this is not very stable. And it reminds me of someone I know. <gasps> Everything is under control. My eyes twitching. I'm stressed. Okay, I think this is looking good. Did someone step on it? Excuse me, I need your help. You need to kill me. Okay, this is the last step. What do you guys think? Ah, I did it. Now I have to wrap it. <laughs> and I don't know how to flip it. Um, come on, then you think. Think. Okay, so we're facing some technical difficulties right now. I am uh, currently losing my mind. I can't mess this up now. Everything is going so well. Ah, maybe if I use a plate, I can just, you know? But then what if the plate is too heavy and just... 
smashes everything. No, that's not an option. Oh, maybe I can use one of these. Hold on, hold on. Hold. Some thinking is happening. Thinking is happening. Wait a minute. Oh my God, I'm genius. Here's how I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna put some foil on my plate. Scoop my sandwich. Place it on the plate. Oh my God. Mama, thank you for giving birth to me. The world needs my genius. Now I'm gonna get rid of this. There we go. Where is my Sharpie? My Sharpie? Where is my Sharpie? Where is my... I found it. In one video that I saw online, they actually mark how they're supposed to cut it later on. I'm gonna steal that idea. All right, this is ready to go in the fridge. <laughs> Listen, I'm already a little exhausted. I read somewhere that the gut is the second brain of the body. Like they're finding connection between the gut and the brain. But I think for me, it's a little different. I think that there is a connection between the butt, not the gut, the butt and my brain. Because when I'm sitting down, I'm doing things better. I can't explain it, but when I'm using my butt, I'm also being able to use my brain better make it make sense i don't know it might be also called being lazy but now i'm gonna try to do this sandwich yeah i don't have pink bread but yeah i got a yellow one wait there's a hole in it yeah yeah <laughs> oh no <laughs> Absolutely phenomenal every time. How do they do it? Oh my god. Bread is like pasta's cousin. Of course it's amazing. Something very weird happened here. Okay. This is the first time I catch myself doing something like this. I think I'm gonna do only one flower. So first strawberry goes here. Looking at the footage, I'm like, what was I doing? Yeah. 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 Maybe I was just talking to myself. And then... Uh, but that was not even the weird part. What was super odd is that I got so focused, so passionate, that I completely stopped talking. I think I forgot I was filming a video. I was completely lost somewhere in the sandwich zone. Well, that hand was definitely plotting something. And when I finally came back to planet Earth, the only thing I had to say is, I'm gonna be so lucky if this works. Oh, it's so heavy. It's enormous. Well, good luck to me. I really wanted to make these, but I ordered my buns online and um, this is what I received. <laughs> They're quite tiny. So uh, I had to turn to something I'm not exactly thrilled about. The crustless bread. Desperate times call for desperate measures. I am so ready for this one. Oh no, I'm out of cream. Hold on, let me go mix some more. This looks like tangerine, but... I'm gonna use an orange and hope it works. I lost my knife again. Oh, found it. I'm very confident that if I put it like this. I'm gonna get the result I want. It will work. I'm gonna need one more orange because I kind of ate the other half of this one. <laughs> it's in a better place now. Somewhere warm, somewhere safe. <laughs> now, one thing that you should know about me is that I love paying great attention to the details. And when I say details, I mean the small things that don't really matter. See those white bits on the peeled orange? Yes. Yeah. I saw them too. <laughs> I spent 28 minutes trying to remove them. Let's all take a moment of silence for my sanity. It's gone, but never forgotten. For the ears, I'm using strawberries and grapes. This is going to be something like a fruit salad trapped in a sandwich. And I'm wrapping it up by wrapping it up and this is ready to go chill in the fridge. You wanna know what happened behind the scenes? 
Okay, I'm gonna tell you. <laughs> that same evening, as my sandwiches were just chilling in the fridge, minding their own business, I decided I should pop over to my local grocery store. I just wanted to buy some frozen pizza, okay? Let's be real, who cooks after cooking? Definitely not me. And that's when it happened. Oh my God, I couldn't believe my eyes. My eyes popped out of my head when I saw it. Right there in front of me, whispering my name. Sando bread? Danny! I thought no one sells it over here. These kind of sandwiches are not popular in my country. I've never seen them anywhere here. Finding Sando bread in my local grocery store? Huh? What? There is no way. That felt like I found a unicorn. So I did what had to be done. I rescued that majestic loaf from the filthy shelves of the grocery store to my soft, cozy couch. I don't know if a slice of sando is too thick or a slice of ordinary bread is too thin. The difference is absolutely mind-blowing. I prefer sando. Let's make it the new normal. So late at night, once I had my frozen pizza, when everyone was asleep, I was determined to make the best sando sandwich the world have ever seen. a little too confident. <laughs> the next day. I made six sandwiches. That's either impressive or a cry for help. Time to cut them. I think this one is the first one that I made. Well, moment of truth, everyone. <gasps> it worked. Hold on, I need to take a selfie with this one. I don't know if the other ones will be that good. Look at how good they turned out. I made this. Okay, now the big question is how do I eat? Do I start from the edge? What happened to the strawberry? Okay, the edge is okay. Do I bite it in the middle like a savage? It's very good. Next sandwich. This one is looking thick. Oh, oh, oh. no. I mean, yes. No way this worked. No, there is no way this worked. Wow, this was the super extra mega challenging one. This was one of the highest difficulties sandwiches that I did. And I can't believe this worked. Let me transfer it into a plate. I have great news, everyone. The sandu sandwiches are sandu sandwiching. Everything is going amazing. Although one of them is missing an ear. <laughs> but that's not important right now. Missing ear. <laughs> Never heard of it. I believe this is my first time attempting to draw with chocolate. Clearly I'm nailing it. I'm pretty sweet at it. Oh, I messed it up. Now regarding the missing ear, I have a suspicion that it might have accidentally took a trip into my mouth. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I can't find it anywhere. I don't know where it went. The ear was last seen here. No one ever saw him after that. Looks like it vanished without a trace. But don't worry, I'm gonna use my unbelievably realistic drawing skills to give it a fake one. Nobody's gonna know it's fake, I promise. Outlining the bears, cats, what even are those? I don't know. But outlining them seemed fun. At this point, I'm, I'm just playing. I melted way too much chocolate, so I'm just trying to do something with it. Oh, let's give this one a little bit of an attitude. Let me introduce the gang, the crew. This is fake ear Jack. And this, this is Grumpy Mike. Over here we have the little George, he's always smiling. And this is chill, Jane. <laughs> Next sandwich. This one is falling apart. I don't know about this one. This one is stressing me out. <laughs> oh, the cream has just spilled to the side. Oh, I'm so excited to see how it turned out. Oh, this one is the flower one. Oh, I'm so excited. <laughs> well, it looks like everything was going way too well. This is how it was supposed to look. Expectations versus reality. Who's responsible for this mess? Well, there goes my flower. Anyways, um, moving on. Ah, this is the sandal bread. This 
is made with the bread that these sandwiches are supposed to be made with. I'm gonna unwrap it. Okay, here we go. Oh, it looks absolutely amazing. This is how it's supposed to look. I should have taken a selfie with this one. This one looks so much better. <laughs> look at the difference the bread makes. This will never stop being exciting, okay? It's like unwrapping a Christmas gift. Every time I cut into one of these sandwiches, I'm gonna be like, <gasps> wow! Oh, I didn't bite into the strawberry. so good. <laughs> this is not a sandwich, it's a cake. I got a little creative with this last two. I got a little playful and I added some color to the whipped cream. And with this one, I was trying to recreate the sandwich with the hearts. I didn't have pink bread, but I have yellow whipped cream. I don't know if it was a good idea, but we're about to find out. I need to go take a plate. This one deserves a plate. Okay, um, I'm in shock. I'm uh, shaking right now. <laughs> I can't believe I made... I made this. I was not supposed to be good at this. Oh, someone is calling me. Tit? Yes, hello, you're speaking to Denny, the greatest sandu sandwich maker of all time. How can I help you? Hello, I would like to file a missing ear report. Uh, I think you called the wrong number. I'm sorry, what? I can't hear you. My ear is missing. This is so confusing because when I'm trying to make something, especially with food, okay, I'm usually failing like pretty bad. So this feels odd. Success feels odd. I don't know how to feel about it. Listen, things are going way too well. Something bad will ha I can, f I can feel it. Something bad is about to happen. Everything is just way too good. Hmm. Okay, now I'm scared. Universe, we need to have a talk. Can you? Are you available right now? Ain't nobody got time for that. Listen, there are way too many things that are going right. What are you preparing for me? This is starting to get suspicious. It's like when you're having an exam and there are too many same answers in a row. Like A, 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 A. And you're like, huh, that doesn't look right. That's suspicious. That's how I'm feeling right now. This is my A, A, A. I have some more over there. Um. But anyways, look at this. <laughs> it is so adorable. I made little hearts out of strawberries and I put them in the sandwich and it looks so cute. Okay, we're moving on to the final boss. <laughs> now for this one, I thought I could do something of my own. I wanted the cream to come out a little more mint, a little more bluish, you know? I wasn't going for green. Never. <laughs> Inside, I put some strawberries and some peaches. I tried to make a pattern, but I don't know. I don't know how it's gonna look. Oh yeah, it looks terrible. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> I don't think we need a plate for this one. <laughs> ah, universe, I see it now. Yeah. Yeah, it's not the best, but come on, it could have been a lot worse. Oh, it's good. <laughs> and this bread. <laughs> Well, bye. This bread is absolutely amazing. Should I film more videos like this? Let me know. And if you enjoyed watching this one, I think you might also like watching this. You can find me on Instagram, Facebook, TikTok. Thank you guys so, 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 so much for watching. And hopefully I'll see you in my next one. Bye. Mwah.